This is Darshan Agauchen with your B2B Cambodia market update for July 8, 2024. The Cambodia Securities Exchange Index was up by 1.16 points or 0.28% to 417.92. Total trade volume was down from Friday to a very light 85,129 shares changing hands at a total trade value of 504.4 million Khmer real or roughly 122,600 US dollars. On the main board, five stocks were up. The Phnom Penh Autonomous Port led the market up 3.61% or 600 real to 17,240 real per share. Following in second was the Sienegville Autonomous Port, up 1.66% or 200 real to 12,220 real per share. Other stocks up were Royal Group Phnom Penh Special Economic Zone, MJQ Education, and Grand Twins International. Only one company was down today. The Phnom Penh Water Supply Authority was down 0.56% to 7,040 real per share. Pesek Cambodia and Akleda Bank remained flat. On the growth board, both stocks were up. JS Land was up 1.94% or 70 real to 3,680 real per share, while DBD Engineering was up 0.97% or 20 real to 2,080 real per share. DBD Engineering was also the overall trade volume leader of the day, with 22,693 shares changing hands at a value of 46.7 million Khmer real or 11,360 US dollars, equivalent to 20.6% of all shares traded on the growth and main boards combined on July 8th. Royal Group Phnom Penh SEZ closed with the second highest trade volume of the day, recording a total of 21,295 shares traded at a value of 48.3 million real or 11,745 US dollars, equivalent to roughly 19.4% of total trade volume. In other market news, the Securities and Exchange Regulator of Cambodia published its quarterly bulletin report reviewing the state of the Cambodian securities market in the first quarter of 2024. The Cambodia securities market's total market cap at the end of Q1 2024 was approximately 12.37 trillion Khmer real, or approximately 3.06 billion US dollars, with a total trade volume of 3.39 million shares, with activity on the main board accounting for 95.91% of all shares traded. In the bond market, there was no trading recorded of any corporate bonds in the first quarter of this year. Akleda Bank was the highest traded company in this quarter, accounting for 21.29% of all shares traded, followed by MJQ Education with 8.69% and CAMGSM with 6.99%. The Khmer real strengthened to 4,117 real per US dollar, while the US dollar index was slightly down to 104.95. Oil prices slid on Monday after rising for four weeks as the prospect of a ceasefire deal in Gaza eased tensions in the Middle East, while investors assessed potential disruption to US energy supplies from Hurricane Barrel. Brand crude futures were down 49 cents or 0.57% at 86.05 US dollars a barrel. US West Texas intermediate crude was at 82.53 US dollars a barrel, down 63 cents or 0.76%. Gold prices also slipped as investors booked profits after soft US jobs data fueled prices to a more than a month high on rising expectations that the US Federal Reserve will begin cutting interest rates in September. Spot gold fell 0.9% to 2,370 US dollars per ounce after rising to its highest level since May 22nd last Friday. US gold futures eased 0.8% to 2,377.50 US dollars. Stock futures were flat Monday as investors await key inflation data for further clues on the longevity of this year's market rally. Earnings from some major financial grants and consumer companies are also on the docket. S&P 500 futures fell marginally, while futures tied to the Dow Jones Industrial Average traded just above the flat line. NASDAQ 100 futures, meanwhile, dipped about 0.1%. This was Darshan Agauchen with your B2B Cambodia Market Update for July 8th.